Hello everyone, this is John. Welcome back to the Fantasy Channel. Today I'm going to be reviewing this Van Leeuwen's Hidden Valley Ranch Ice Cream. A lot of people have already reviewed this, uh, but when it came out I was busy so I didn't do it. But now I am. Most of the reviews for this have been bad, so I'm expecting this not to be great. Uh, in the case, or in any case, whether or not it's great or not, I'm going to be uh, doing a second part of this review, and I'm going to be reviewing these. These are called Cheetos Spicy Mania. They are a rare flavor uh, from Japan, and it's got habanero and bonito, which is a dry fish flavor. Um, and this is only the second time that uh, Japan has ever released this for a limited time, so. We're going to try it out. You know, spicy Cheetos and ranch. They seem to go together. Plus, if something spicy, you need something cold to help you out. So maybe this will be a perfect combination. We'll find out. Anyway, let's go ahead and try the ice cream. Very ranchy smelling. It looks like looks like ice cream. It smells like ranch. Here we go. Hidden Valley Ranch ice cream. Thumbs up. Yeah. I uh, don't suggest it. Um, man, uh, it does taste like ranch. And I agree with all the other reviewers. It's not good. Uh, it's... It's got like a sickening flavor to it. It doesn't, it doesn't taste like the good parts of ranch. Hmm. Yeah. I think that bite's going to be mainly it. I might try one of the Cheetos, a little bit of the ice cream on top for some content. But here we go. The Spicy Mania Cheetos from Japan. This is a rare Cheetos flavor. It smells like okay. Um, so it does smell like bonito y, like fishy. Here, give it a smell. I'll tell you what the, the smell really reminds me of, um, and it's not that appetizing. Um, the smell of like a dried cat food. When dry cat food usually has like a salmon or something in there and has that smell. This kind of smells like that. Or maybe even like fish food, like a really stale fishy smell. And we'll try it out. There's a bunch of uh, warnings on here about like, if you don't like spice, this is bad. Don't give it to your children. But when I translated the ingredients, habanero was the only spice. I'm not saying that's not spicy. Habanero is spicy. But it's not like ghost pepper. Here we go. Hmm. Hmm. It is spicy. But it's got like different waves of flavor and then the spice hits you. There's like a slight sweetness first and then when the sweetness like melts away then it's like this umami which has to be that bonito flake.
if you've ever had like a, a dashi or like a fish broth that's the flavor and then just an overwhelming warm punch The heat is almost, let's say, hidden behind this immediate sweetness, followed by really rich umami, and then pow, heat. I'm going to try one with just a bit of ranch ice cream on it. Still bad. All right. Well, <coughs> a little bit of that hot powder just hit me right in the back of the throat. Whew. And there's the hiccups. All right, well, we got an interesting combo combo here. We have the really bad, highly do not recommend Van Leeuwen Ranch Ice Cream. Two thumbs down. Zero out of ten. And we have the really complex, sweet umami, and then a lot of heat. Spicy Mania Cheetos from Japan, which have this incredible umami flavor and then an equally incredible punch of spice uh, to the throat. Um, anyway, hope you enjoyed this video. I'm going to go wash my hands before I do anything else. Thumbs up. See you in the next one. So long. Goodbye.